always in the data, bro. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I'll, I'll get it. Today means today I'll get it done. Yeah, yeah, I collected 18 laptops already. Only 80 more to go. Nothing to worry, sir. You know I'm your guy, sir. Sir, nothing to worry, sir. You know I'm the guy, sir. I'm invested in the growth of the company. Yeah, I'm invested in the growth of the comp organization. Uh, okay, sir. Thank you, sir. Bro, what is this, bro? I'm the chief crisis manager of this place. No one treats me like a human being. They think I'm the Wi-Fi man, pizza man, laptop maintenance boy. One fellow's coming and asking, bro, I've got water on my laptop. What to do? Go try it, bro. Why are you asking me? No, no, no. If you don't return your laptop today, we'll have to cut it from your FNF. Yeah, Roy, the mouse also belongs to the company only. You please send the laptop back. Hello? Hi, Tasha. Yeah, how are you, man? Ah, oh, good, good. No, nothing. No, 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 no. Nothing urgent. Of course, I can come pick it up if yes, you want. Yes, yes. Why don't I quit my job as crisis manager and become your man instead? A 6 p.m., okay? Okay, okay. No issues. I'll be there. I'll be there. I mean, love is a full-time job after all. Also, Tasha, uh, that day I was asking you whether we can get a cup of coffee. Ha Hello? Hello, Tasha? Laugh, bro, laugh. 100 plus people have quit in the last 10 days and I'm banging my head to retrieve all their laptops and give it to the new joinees. Listen to this list, bro. Priya, one non-veg meal. Ankur, pure veg bracket Jain. Shaina, petas... Pekalas... Pekatetari... What is he eating? Pets or what? Alok, egatarian. Samudra, pure non-veg. This Samudra is cracking jokes. I'll crack his head during the lunch. Okay? Hello, Samudra? Yeah, your lunch has been cancelled for tomorrow. Mm, because you didn't pick the right option. Ah. Bro, you have to ask for a raise. I mean, this is the most important job in the office, you know. Correct. You get me, bro. Welcome, new joiners. Listen to me carefully. I'm going to tell which laptop belongs to whom, okay? And then you can go collect it. Uh, the one with the sticker that says uh, work, S-U-X, no, that belongs to you, Shobit. Uh, all the best. Uh, Pooja, yours is the one with that Superman hugging Batman sticker. No, Pooja, sorry. The company cannot give you the one with the sticker that says uh, Choti Bachi, okay? You're on Little Girl Award. Hey, company has given it to Ramya Ma. Chumma, don't keep asking same questions. Okay, everyone started, no? Oh, okay, bye. Bro, honestly, you should open a startup. It should be called Nitin Electronics. Bro, I swear, sometimes all this quitting noise is just making me want to quit life. What if I told you that you could have predicted how many people were going to quit and placed the order for the right amount of laptops? Yo, Saniswara, please take this data scientist guru and give my friend guru back. Yeah, yeah, act like an ass right now. When your boss fires you, you'll be like, Oh, sir, I'm an ass set to the company, sir. Hey, bro, what? Hey, why is the boss calling me again? What's his problem, bro? This fellow likes my company more than his own company. Chuck it. You give me gyan, bro. No, no, no. It's cool, bro. I'm not giving you my help now. Guruji, please. And what will Guruji get in return? I'll do the dishes for three days. We are not impressed. Think from the heart, Veta. I'll wash your clothes for five days. No underwear, but... Hmm. Sounds interesting. Will you also wash the car? Bro, whatever you want, I'll wash you. Please, you just tell me, you know. One second. Yes, sir. No, no, no. I'm just negotiating with the sales guy. Yeah, yeah. I'll get it done, sir. No problem. Yeah, yeah. Today only. Today. Yeah, bye. Please, bro. Please, just help me, please. This Bhaskaran is eating my... One second, bro. Hey, Shetty. Where is the laptop, man? Why have you done so it? Why? No brains you have or what? Hey, you keep the phone. Bro, please tell me how I can predict. I can't take this anymore. Are you ready? I'm done. Because Guruji is finally ready to teach you. Alright, let's go. Where? Yeah, again you brought me here. How did your clothes change? So bro, big companies are using machine learning to predict attrition of an employee. Machine learning has shown that, say, Shetty was performing well and he showed growth on May 7th. Now, after that, if he hasn't completed a task and basically Shetty has been a shitty employee for about 181 days, which is... 181 by 30... Six months, bro. He's going to leave by next year. Now, you can study the behavior of these employees and call them the to-be-quitters pool. Bro, I think if I don't fix this laptop situation soon, I'll also be in this pool. Now, based on this, you get employees who have finished their tasks, meaning they possibly won't be leaving, and others who haven't, who will possibly put in their papers soon. But you have to know that the longer your employee track record, the better your prediction will be. So many employees come and say at the end moment that they quit because the company didn't give them enough money. Yes, that can be tracked too. So there are features that have high and low effect on attrition. Like the high effect ones are less money, long working hours, young in age and overtime. So what about people who are married? Marital status is one factor that has an anomaly. 
If we see from the data, an employee with a single marital status has a more significant number in attrition than those who are married or divorced. Bro, this machine learning is some max level stalking. So, it will be able to tell who's dating whom also. Now, depending on the company and the industry they're in, we can figure out the relative importance of these factors. These factors accordingly will be given weights based on which the algorithm will determine a score. Think of it like coefficients to a variable in an equation. This weight is decided with the help of historical data. The model keeps on improving the weights until it gets to a stage where there's no more improvement possible. Now, there are only two possible outcomes here. Either the employee stays or they quit. To determine this, we can use a logistic regression model here, which does the same. What happens is that we keep a threshold value of 0.5 Anything higher than 0.5 will mean that the employee is more likely to quit. If it's below 0.5, the employee is likely to stay. Hello? Ah, yes, sir. Uh, where are you right now? No, there's one more laptop now that Roy Shetty gave you. Uh, hello? Hello? Anna? Anna? Hello? Anna, I can't hear you. Anna, my company needs that laptop. Hello? Hey, not Anna. Data, bro. Data would have solved your problems. Hey. Hey, Shetty, your delivery guy is not even picking up the call. Which guy did you give it to? Company doesn't care if he comes on a horse or a unicorn. You get that laptop here. Do it fast. I'm going to use all this data to ruin this Shetty's life. Thanks, Guru. The next morning. No work today, bro. I hear you're becoming employee of the year with data. No, bro. I just tracked my own employee history and predicted that I'm never quitting this job. I'm stuck here forever. That's not how you're supposed to be using data, bro. If you want to know how data plays a role around you with real-life case studies like this, check out the Data Science and Machine Learning course on Scalar.